Okay, this ice bucket challenge is a bit different. This is to raise awareness as well as funding for for research into uh, rare diseases. Since rare diseases, as the term implies, are rare, there's not too much incentive or interest for the big pharmaceutical companies, many of them, to invest into research into rare diseases. So we, as the um, group of people from the University of Zurich, Schlier and Campus, we try to uh, do this ice bucket challenge to raise awareness for for uh, uh, rare diseases so that the pharmaceutical industries could now focus more on developing drugs for very, very rare diseases, like including ALS. And it's not just for the ALS, but including ALS. Well, the Ice Bucket Challenge is a bit different. We have an aufmerksamkeit erhöhen and we have a forschungsgeld in the area of seltenen Krankheitsbildern, like for example ALS, but also other Krankheiten. Wir äh, sind da als äh, ganze Gruppe, Forschungsteam von Campus Lier und in Zürich, um das zu unterstützen. Und weil es nicht so, äh, so viele Pharmafirmen gibt, die Interesse haben, in diesem Bereich ihre Forschungs- und Entwicklungsgelder zu investieren, vertreten wir diesen Standpunkt hier vertreten und hoffen, dass dadurch das angeregt wird, äh, die Forschung in diesem Bereich äh, zu stärken. Zur Ice Bucket Challenge. Äh, ce Ice Bucket Challenge est un peu différent. Nous le faisons non seulement pour ALS, mais aussi pour toutes les maladies rares. C'est pour soutenir, sensibiliser, mais aussi récolter des fonds pour toutes les maladies rares. Ce sont des maladies très rares et donc elles sont délaissées par les compagnies pharmaceutiques. Et donc nous, à l'Université de Zurich et Campus de Schlieren, nous avons voulu faire ce, ce défi en groupe pour sensibiliser l'opinion publique à la lutte contre les maladies rares. Questa Ice Bucket Challenge è un po' differente perché l'idea è quella di richiamare l'attenzione, possibilmente non solo quella ma anche dei fondi, su quelle che sono le malattie rare e non soltanto sulla SLA. E proprio perché come il nome stesso dice, su queste malattie sono rare e le industrie farmaceutiche non investono molto in questa direzione. Quindi il nostro obiettivo è quello di sensibilizzare non soltanto la gente ma anche le industrie farmaceutiche stesse su promuovere la ricerca in questo senso. So now we nominate the CEO of Novartis, Mr. Joseph Jimenez, the CEO of Roche, Mr. Severin uh, Schwann, and also the president of the Swiss National Science Foundation, Mr. Martin Vetterli, either to do exactly the, what we did and to donate to the rare disease foundations or to focus more um, on researchers uh, on, on rare diseases and to increase the funding for research on rare diseases so that we could find cure for many of these diseases, including ALS. There will be a small fund that we collect now, uh, and um, this will be given to the Synapsis Foundation, which is in Zurich, which also funds ALS research. So, here we go.